Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park Toledo located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this 2010 Toyota RAV4 Limited. Now the most notable features on the Limited is its power moonroof, its heated front seats, as well as its backup camera. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this 2010 Toyota RAV4 Limited. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on the limited model is its daytime running lights. You also have your fog lamps and then if we take a look at your front grille here, you're going to see your block heater. Over on the side, you have your 17 inch aluminum alloy wheels. Taking a look on your mirrors here, you have your integrated signal lamps as well as your mirrors that fold in and out. And then the other nice thing with the limited models, it does have this marquee system with it. So with the smart key system, you can lock all the doors simultaneously just by pushing the little button you see here on the side. Push on it once, it'll lock all the doors automatically, and if you put your hand between the handle here, it'll unlock the front door for you as well. Now this is all possible just as long as you do keep the key fob on you at all times. You have your roof rack, and the color we're going to be taking a look at today is Blizzard Pearl. Now to start off with, we're going to be taking a look at your front dash as well as your front seats, just so you have a much better idea of how much space there is. Now you have your light gray leather interior seat surfaces with your power driver's seat with lumbar support. Taking a look just over on your left hand side, you're going to see your AC 112 volt on and off. And then you also have your light controls for your automatic uh, daytime running lights. On the inside of your driver's side door you have your window locks, power locks, window controls, both your front and rear windows. A couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your volume control, your uh, mode select, scroll function, display, and then you have your cruise control. Now the other nice thing with the limited models, it does have that push button start, so all you have to do is put your foot on the brake, hit the push button, and it'll start up for you automatically. And then just by hitting your display button here, you can see a couple of different options on there, including your exterior temperature gauge, as well as your average liters every 100 kilometers, and a couple of other additional features. Now we're going to be taking a look at your center dash as well as your AM FM CD player. Now the other nice thing here is that you also have your satellite radio. So if you wanted to listen to different stations just while you're out on the highway, you can do so. You have your all-wheel drive lock, hazard lights. Down below you have your temperature control settings for your dual zone climate control. Underneath you'll find your traction control on and off, heated seat controls for your driver and passenger, window wiper de-ice, your, uh, sorry, your power outlet. Matted to an automatic transmission, you also have your mirror controls as well as your auxiliary input. At the very top you have your auto dimming rearview mirror, and this is also where your backup camera will actually show up, just in your uh, top left hand corner. And at the very top you'll find your open and closed for your power moonroof with your sunglass case holder. Now if you do forget your sunglasses, you do have these visor extenders, just look at it on your driver and passenger side. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your tailgate. Now look at it on the back of your tailgate here. You're going to see your backup camera just located on your far right hand side. And then if we just open up the back here, I'm just going to close in on your rear cargo area just so you have a much better idea of how much space there is. So one of the nice things with this cargo space here is that you also have a tunnel cover included with it. So if you wanted to make sure your valuables are actually covered up, you can use the tunnel cover to do so. Now if you do need some additional cargo space, if you take a look underneath the floor here, you have some under the floor storage where you can hide away some of your valuables just while you're going from store to store, or like I said, if you need the extra cargo space. Now the other nice thing is you can actually fold down that 40-20-40 split uh, rear seat just in case you do need the additional cargo space. And if we actually just take a look on the back of the tailgate here, you'll also find your spare tire as well as your spare tire uh, cover on there as well. Thank you so much folks for watching this video today. If you have any questions on this 2010 Toyota RAV4 Limited, please visit us. We're located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. The phone number is 780-410-2455 or please visit our website at sptoyota.com to get us by email. Once again folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day and I hope to see you next time.